Hello, Sterile Processing Universe, and welcome to this episode of Real Talk with Bob Mars. I'm super excited to be here with you today. Um, I want to continue our series on Did You Know? And today's question, Did You Know?, is Did you or do you know what impact sets that are missing instruments on the shelf sterile ready to go to the operating room have on the operating room? Well, this depends on a couple of things. So um, I'd like to tell you what I used to do as a leader uh, when I had sets that were missing instruments and how we dealt with that. Uh, I hated to see sets missing instruments on the shelf. So as I did my daily rounding and my sterile processing, if I saw a set on the shelf that was missing an instrument, I wanted to know what was missing and why it was missing and why that set was on the shelf. Uh, I, the bottom line is when these sets go to the operating room, if they are missing instruments, it can be a catastrophe if the operating room staff doesn't notice that the set is missing an instrument before they take it to the operating room. Number one, the set could be in use during the procedure and then the surgeon asks for an instrument and then they realize they don't have it, so this sends the circulating nurse scrambling. Uh, number two, it can cause serious frustration with the surgeon. So we wanna make sure that never happens. So I'd recommend a couple of things. Number one, if you have enough sets, I would recommend that you never place a set missing instruments on your shelves, sterile, ready to go to the operating room. Number two, before you do this, uh, I would always have my lead tech or my supervisor talk to the OR clinician in charge of whatever specialty that set goes with. So if it's a CV set or an ortho set or a neuro set, I would ask that clinician the question, this set is missing this instrument or these instruments. Is it okay to put this set up without them? Will it impact the surgery? If the answer is yes, do not put that set on the shelf until those instruments are ordered and that set is complete. This is really a simple way to ensure that you're not having issues on a daily basis. You're not delaying surgery. You're not frustrating OR staff. You're not frustrating uh, the OR physician, the surgeon that's performing the surgical procedure. It's a great way for us to grow our communication between the operating room and sterile processing, and also to ensure that we're sending a quality product to the OR each and every time. I hope you've learned something today, and I hope you never have to place an incomplete set on your shelves ever again. This has been Bob Mars, and this is Real Talk. <laughs>